Have you ever noticed that airplane food just doesn't taste the same? Why does food lose its flavor the moment you're in the sky? It's not because of the fridge or that tiny plastic fork. There's actual science behind it, and it's weirder than you think. At cruising altitude, the cabin is pressurized to about 8,000 feet. That's like being on top of a mountain, and it changes how we taste. Pressure, less taste, sensitivity. The air inside a plane is extremely dry, less than 20% humidity. This lack of humidity dries out your nose and mouth, dulling your sense of smell. And since smell makes up 80% of taste, your food instantly becomes less flavorful. Believe it or not, the constant engine noise also affects how we taste. Studies show loud environments reduce our ability to detect sweet and salty flavors. To fight this, airline chefs add extra salt, spices, and umami-rich ingredients like tomatoes and mushrooms to boost flavor. Why do your ears pop on a plane? Ever feel like your ears are about to pop during takeoff? That's because of changing air pressure. As the plane rises, the pressure in the cabin drops quickly, but the pressure inside your middle ear stays the same. That creates a pressure imbalance and your ears feel blocked. It can help to gently open your mouth, just like this, so the pressure in your ears can release. But be careful. If you open too wide or too suddenly, you might hear a little pop or crackling sound. That's usually nothing to worry about, but don't force it. Just take it slow, stay relaxed. Now you know why your ears pop during takeoff and why airplane food tastes a little bland. Up there, the air is thinner, the pressure lower, and your body feels every bit of it. Want to keep learning amazing things about the world around you? Subscribe for free to Wonderworld TV and discover something new every week. Wonderworld TV, where wonder begins.